Welcome to the video on guidelines to source products to sell on Amazon. Do you consider what you will sell on Amazon? It's important to understand Amazon's guidelines. As an Amazon seller, you may sell products from a third-party brand or products under your own label. If you have chosen to become a seller on Amazon, it's important to understand our expectations and policies to source products. Amazon respects the intellectual property rights of others. As a seller, you are responsible for ensuring that the products you sell on Amazon comply with all applicable laws and regulations, are authorized for sale or resale, and do not violate intellectual property rights such as copyrights, patents, trademarks, and rights of publicity. Here are five important guidelines to consider while sourcing products to sell on Amazon. Number one, validate your suppliers. As a seller, you are responsible for sourcing and selling authentic products. If you're selling branded products, it's always best to source products directly from the brand or from one of their direct distributors or wholesalers. If you're purchasing branded products through a distributor or wholesaler, you'll need to validate their relationship to the brand. How to do that? Here are some sources of information that will help you verify the reliability of a supplier. Their business license, brand authorization letter, office and warehouse locations, business bureau ratings, and other sources of information that speak to the credibility of the supplier, such as their online and social media presence, amount of time they have been offering specific brands or products, news articles, and potentially more. It's also a good idea to review the About Us section on a company's website to understand their history, current performance plan, as well as plans for the future. Number two, build relationship with brands. Although you may be able to purchase products from a trustworthy supplier, for some products you may still be required to get explicit permission from the brand in order to sell their products on Amazon. Hence, it's important to build a relationship with brands to ensure that you're meeting all the brand requirements and Amazon policies for selling these branded products. Number three, retain business invoices. Amazon may request that you provide documentation, such as invoices showing the authenticity of your products or authorization to list them for sale. When purchasing products that you plan to sell on Amazon, be sure to retain all your invoices. Invoices help substantiate that you have purchased the products from a valid supplier. Invoices will have key pieces of information, such as the supplier's name, address, and contact details. You may remove pricing information when providing these documents to Amazon, but the rest of the documents must be visible. The document should have an itemized list of products with description and quantity for the items you have purchased. It should also be dated within the last 365 days for any products you intend to sell in new condition. Number four, understanding Amazon's drop shipping policy. Amazon allows sellers to drop ship products as defined by our drop shipping policy, which can be found on Seller Central by typing drop shipping policy in the search bar. To properly conduct drop shipping, sellers must first validate that the drop shipper is a valid supplier for the item they intend to sell. Once it's determined that suppliers are valid, ensure that there is a signed and dated service level agreement formalizing the relationship between you and your drop shipping supplier. To comply with Amazon's drop shipping policy, you must be the seller of record of your products. Identify yourself as the seller of your products on all packing slips, invoices, external packaging, and other information included or provided in connection with them. Remove any packing slips, invoices, external packaging, or other information identifying a third-party dropshipper prior to shipping the order. Be responsible for accepting and processing customer returns of your products. We would like to point out that dropshipping retail to retail is strictly prohibited on Amazon. Number five, auctions or auction style environments are not considered valid sources of supply. Reselling products that are intended for destruction, disposal, or otherwise designated as unsellable by the manufacturer, supplier, vendor, or retailer is strictly prohibited on Amazon. What if you are a brand owner? If you have your own trademark, you can sell products as a brand owner. 
brand owners who have registered trademarks can take advantage of all the benefits, protections, and programs offered with Amazon's brand registry program. Private label, handmade, or customized products are also allowed on Amazon. You are responsible for ensuring that the products you sell on Amazon comply with all applicable laws and regulations, are authorized for sale or resale, and do not violate intellectual property rights such as copyrights, patents, trademarks, and rights of publicity. It's important to keep documents to substantiate your relationship with your own products. An example would be invoices for raw materials or finished products. They should contain the supplier's name, address, and contact information, along with your business name, address, and contact information. The invoices should be itemized with description and quantity for the products purchased. You may remove pricing information when providing these documents to Amazon, but the rest of the document must be visible. This Thank you and happy selling in the Amazon store!